here. Kevin Farley joins us this morning. There's really nothing wrong with a good buffet, Kevin. I'm blown away that you were a little disappointed to say that. That's all right. How you doing this morning, man? Uh, I'm good. I'm good. Yeah, mom fed me, fed me well. I don't like that because my shirt was too tight during that uh, special and I was about ready to pop out of that one. <laughs> I'll give you a quick suggestion. Real quick, we got Kevin Farley with us this morning. Thanks for joining us, Kevin. Re a quick yeah. suggestion. People will be like, you look like you lost weight. Wear bigger shirts. And then people no, like, I know. Oh, there you and go, I right? try. They don't make quadruple XL. No, I'm not quite that big. But you're right. That is a secret. And untucking your shirt is another Well, we talked a little bit. good thing. Yeah, oh, the untucked look is a slick <laughs> look. And you're going to be having a slick look this weekend when you're bringing us a couple of comedy shows to the St. Louis region. Yeah. No buffets at the Westport Social. But there's going to be a lot of people there ready to laugh. What time are you guys going on stage? Uh, let's see, 7.30 mm -hmm. at tonight and 9.30. Okay, and that's over so at Westport two. Social. You got that's two? That's right. I got two tonight, yeah. Okay, and then you're going to carry that over, over to the streets of St. Charles Saturday and Sunday, it sounds like. That's right. I have two uh, on Saturday and uh, one on Sunday, I think. All right. Well, you're no stranger to comedy. How did you get involved in comedy, and how was your family supporting this? <laughs> that's a good, <laughs> a good question. Well, the, you know, my wife... Uh, she's she was a writer mm -hmm. she is a writer and so uh, she sort of is she's good with it all you know I'm gone a lot of weekends I'm traveling and that kind of thing and it's, it's a different life but uh, you know you get used to it I think uh, I've been doing it for so long that you just kind of get used to it and I think I've been you know when I started at Second City I did the improv world and then I switched over to stand-up so it's kind of like both worlds uh, that I that I've lived in for all these all these times, but I think you know it's a different way of life. You know, uh, I think you have to be sort of in the creative world to uh, to, to to like it. You know, uh huh, absolutely. Yeah. That could you ever imagine 20, 25 years ago that you'd be right here doing this? You had a wild journey. L.A. Yeah. You've been all over Midwest. Now yeah. you're in St. Louis. I was in L.A. for 20 years and. I did the Midwest thing, you know, Chicago, Second City for before that. And then now I live in Florida and I travel the world, you know, not the world. But, yeah. You know, continental you, U.S. Yeah, the U.S. Yeah, <laughs> that sounds good. And right. uh, but yeah, it's good. That's good. Real but quick. I have been around. You have. And we're glad to have you here. And we're looking forward to your show this weekend. We, and as we wrap up with the last question before we go to break, what can people expect from your show? You mentioned it's more of an improv type feel. Uh, sometimes I do a little bit of that in the, in the top of the show, mm -hmm. but I, I talk a lot about uh, this. This show I'm talking about my experience with uh, the quarantine because I know we we found out pretty quickly that stand-up comedians were pretty non-essential, <laughs> you know, and so that kind of hurt our feelings. You know? uh -huh. So we talk. I talk a lot about just being kind of sidelined during the COVID mm -hmm. thing, and then also just how that how I got out of that, and we we made it. Uh, made it through that. You know. definitely got to tread lightly nowadays as a comedian as well, right? Kind of, or do you got to just go with the flow? I'll get canceled sometimes, so might as well be earlier than later. No, I don't know. I hope not. I, I try to, you know, we try to talk about things mm -hmm. as much as we can without. I don't want to offend anyone. Yeah, absolutely. You want to go there and have a good time, laugh, and enjoy yeah, the show. Right? Yeah, yeah. I want to have everybody have a good time. Yeah. So right, yeah. I don't try to get into any kind of, like, controversy. No controversy. No. We're all positive, good time. <laughs> Kev, we got to wrap this up. The show's going to be Friday and Saturday. We're going to have full details on our website, fox2now.com. Kevin, thank you for joining us Hey, this thanks morning. a lot. All yeah. right, we're back with more Fox News in the morning after the break.